I'm done.
Oh, neither of our cameras are on. <laughs> are you kidding me right now? I can do it. No, I, I have to reset them on the Streamlabs. Oh, my gosh. So, we've been having a rough morning. I woke up with a migraine. Uh, almost canceled the stream, but we're going to do it anyway. Oh, yeah. Because... <laughs> Uh, yeah, anyway, I'm not feeling great today, but I'm going to do my best once I get our cameras working. How's everyone doing? I hope you're feeling all right. <laughs> uh, always something. Oh, your camera's not, uh, what? I unplugged your camera last night when I was trying to show Ryan how to get his new camera to work. <clears throat> oh. Well, I can say hello to some people. We have Sammy here with us to a bug from the wedding that they are attending right now. Oh, really? Uh, home no, nice. hello, Paul, Cookie Monster, Glenn Kelly. Nice of you to join us. Matt, Nels thanks for is here. joining <clears throat> us to stare at our black screen. <laughs> Such a nice background we got here. <laughs> uh, that's not right. Here we go. There we go. Kinda. Why does that look so weird? I don't know. You're sitting at a different angle, I think. Or is the I camera different? That's so weird. It looks like the camera's over there. Anyway, this this will work. Oh. Is that the cam like? <laughs> That's so confusing. Okay. <laughs> now my camera's frozen. Are you kidding <laughs> me? <laughs> Sorry about this, everybody. That's funny. <laughs> we'll figure this out. <clears throat> Hello, Casual Chubster and old Mr. B have joined us, too. Okay. Whoops. Don't mind us. And we're both moving now. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Okay, it's Sorry better. about that, everybody. It's like, if anything could possibly go wrong today, it will, is how it's going right now. There we but go. But anyway, thank you all so much for tuning in. Hello, Matt, Cookie Monster, Home Gnome, Paul, Ollie, Sammy, Two-Way Bug, uh, Glenn, Old Mr. B, Casual Chubster, Jokey, Purple Dracos, Good to see everyone. <laughs> Sorry for that uh, <clears throat> weird intro. That was all part of the show. <laughs> yeah, we meant to do that. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Oh, jeez. How are you, Rosie? Uh, I'm fine. I really feel good. Um, my throat's a little bit raspy, as you can see <laughs> or hear. It sounds cute. But other than that, I feel totally fine. So Good. Yeah. I'm glad you're feeling better. I'm still like kind of nervous that i'm gonna get what you had because i always get what you had and this time somehow i skated I think you're by gonna, I, I think you're in the clear now at this point well i thought so too but now i feel like i feel like i might be getting sick now i don't know we anyway booked our flight to boston this morning so that was exciting yes so now we have our trip to seattle for band made completely done and lodging oh, ready and, to go <laughs> yeah Lodging and flight for Boston checked off. So, yeah. Yeah. We almost got everything planned out. Um. Oh, yeah, home gnome. Thank you. Uh, oh, Purple Trick has got to drive back from work. See you in about 45 minutes. Sweet. We might be uh, done with our first video by then. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I wanted to start today's stream with a cool video. I've actually seen this performance before in the live the live stream version, but Yoyoka recently put out on YouTube her Deep Purple Burn cover that she did with the singer from Loudness, Minoru Nihara, and Satsuma3042, the guitarist. So I wanted to show this on the stream. Cool. Enjoy <clears throat> it. It's a pretty crazy professional performance. 
So let me get it all reset here. Let's do this. It was 30 seconds in. <laughs> okay. Cool set. Yeah, this was at a live, an actual live show that she played with her family. Like, there were a bunch of different lineups on stage throughout the show. Mm -hmm. The only through line was Yoyoka, but like Kanaya Yoyoka played. Um, she played a Rage cover that she also released very recently with some other kids, including mm -hmm. Shido. Shido played That's guitar. Cool. Yeah, it was pretty sweet. But, alright. Here we go. Oh, that is such a cool I know. Yoga has a crowdfund going on right now? How did I miss that? Um, where is that? And Josh, welcome. Hey, Josh. Thanks for popping in. And you have a great day, too. Thank you. It's almost over. Hey, Steve, welcome. He's got like the perfect voice yeah. for almost everything they played. Like super powerful. Oh, it was a Japanese only crowdfunding. Oh, gotcha. Gotcha. Okay. Um But yeah, I, I was super impressed with Minoru Nahara's Minoru Nahara's voice during this performance. I really want that hat. <laughs> that is so cool. <laughs> Yeah, except like in America, you'll get like something thrown at you for wearing it, or I don't know. Anyway, her fills in this performance. Like, in my opinion, this drum performance is another, like, few steps higher from her original burn cover. Because now she's really, like, in that first one, you could tell she was really working her butt off to get through the song. But now it's so effortless for her that mm -hmm. she throws in more style to each fill, you know? Because this song's just packed with fills. I hate it when that happens. Oh, so 
really true here. <laughs> what? <laughs> the main singer? No, those are horns, dude. Oh, <laughs> I didn't see the pinky. I'm like, whoa. <laughs> He's just really like <laughs> I haven't heard Woman from Tokyo. Is that a Deep Purple song, I'm guessing? See? I'll just have the song released in 1974. It's way better than 90% of rock radio. I don't even... Where... What is rock radio these days? such a great job selecting performers that would add to the fun atmosphere. Yeah. You know? I've never seen it. Well, I guess I do. But you don't see keyboards get into it like that. notes on the snare too that sounded so simple but she's literally doing snare ghost notes on the offbeat and then doing the kick and hi-hat on the down that was cool the accents in those fills Recently, I think it was on Guys and Guys this week, or maybe when we were just chatting, but Alan and Ryan are both starting to come around on Yayoka because they've watched her stuff and they're like, holy crap, she does stand out from, like, from typical kid drummers, right. for sure, but, like, just such a pro already. That's cool. The style, the groove, the feel. Alan was pretty impressed by her feel. That's a tough question, Paul. I haven't heard Made in Japan by Deep Purple yet. At least not all of it. <laughs> How does he have so much focus stamp?
Dang. Nice. Like, not only is he singing all these incredibly difficult songs throughout mm-hmm. this entire set, but he's also adding stuff like that at the end. Like, how do you even have the voice for this in the middle of a set where every song's already so demanding? Just shows what a seasoned pro he is. Um, he's again, his band's been together since the 80s. So. Love it. I love that sound. 80s rock. Me too. Nostalgia. Yeah. Nostalgia. <laughs> um, when did when did Deep Purple? Oh, 74. Duh, Ollie just said that. So this song came out in 74. But yeah, his band's from the 80s. Anyway. That was cool. It's I'm glad Yoyoka finally is getting these live videos up again because obviously there's a long break there where she couldn't make live stuff and she grew she's grown so much over that time so seeing these live shows again is really exciting i hope that we actually get to see her play live in the future like in person not Mm -hmm. just a video um (laughs) that's a good answer Oh, that's right. The she played this for her birthday too. I'll have to rewatch that. Cause honestly, it's hard to imagine someone better than Minoru Nahara right now. Especially like in this live setting. All right, we should let's. Okay, how about we watch that now, real quick? Okay. I feel like it would be good to see them side by side. Uh, well, let's just type that. Is that not up on YouTube anymore? Twelve. Oh, here it is. I just didn't recognize the thumbnail. Dang, she already... Like, this is only last year, but she looks so much younger here. This was that year between 12 and 13, so one of the most transformative times of your life. Oh, this is the singer. Hijinx, that's in the, in the description. Oh, speaking of which, Simno just uh, converted that list into uh, Google Drive, so it will update automatically, but the location of it is still in that same folder that the other stuff were, but this one, it says new Wave Potter stream database or whatever. So, yeah, that's where you'll find it. There's a link to it in the description of this video and also on my tr- Twitch channel, the About page, with the links. It's in there, too. Fair enough, Matt. <laughs> Vocalists are such a hard thing to compare for me because it's not, you know, it's such a... Every voice is so unique. Yeah, I do. I like the other singers rasp. Yeah, I like so his raspy. his stage <clears throat> stage presence uh-huh. and personality. And his hat. That's like half the performance for me. Yeah. Well, no, that was the guitarist. <laughs> oh the yeah, hat. that's right. I like the <laughs> main guy's scarf choice. It's probably very hot. Uh, <laughs> yes, Ollie, we're moving to Twitch after this. Yeah. I just wanted to see this guy's voice real quick, side by side with the other one, but uh. Yeah, we're. I think we'll move to Twitch right now. Ah. Yeah. Well said, Cookie Monster. So, well, yeah, it's so much to do with personal taste. So it's like, 
Yeah, you like what you like. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's move over to Twitch, and we'll start getting to your requests. Cool. Um, I'm going to pee real quick while we're on our switch Twitch switch break. Cool. But... Ah, oh, community post. Can you do that? Mm-hmm. All right. 